One of the big projects we're working on is the Bidcart, which is implementing hands-on STEM education into the classrooms. Hello everybody, we're here with something exciting for you guys today. We inspire the next generation of scientists, technologists, engineers, and mathematicians. The volunteers have been great. The uh, projects have a goal, but there's also a willingness to be open-ended and allow students to explore, to fail, and to succeed. The project we got to do used LEDs, batteries, and Play-Doh to create circuits. It was one of those projects that ended up being a learning experience as we tried to adjust as students found different ways to make the circuits work. And that epitomizes the whole idea of STEM, is that you're going to experiment. When I was in elementary school, we didn't really do any sort of STEM activities. My first introduction to physics was a textbook, which, in my opinion, is completely terrible. Introducing STEM at an earlier age reinforces the idea that anybody can pursue STEM. Bidcard is nice because it's ready to go. The biggest thing I have to think about is what day I want to schedule it on. I don't have to think about providing materials. I don't have to think about how the lesson is going to go. Large burden is off of me, so I can focus on the other things through the day and have this activity as something that the students really look forward to, but doesn't take all that preparation. At Bit Project, we are breaking down barriers to make STEM accessible to all. We hope that students are able to look at the world and say, hey, I can pursue STEM.